there's a lot of actions you can perform the way. What's up, guys? I'm going to show you a version of the throw, we'll just say Osoto Gari. Uh, I'm going to show the Osoto Atoshi. This is the drop throw version. And we're in here kind of making some videos of some different drop throws today. So, with this Osoto version, uh, what I want you to take into account is this is the one I teach to everybody. Like, our kids and kids' classes, as young as maybe age five, we do, we do that throw. This doesn't require a lot of the typical leg action that you see from a Soto guard reaping back like this, or like uh, using your leg as a hook to lift, right? What I'm gonna do with this is I'm actually gonna punch down, okay? So if you know the throw Tai Toshi, right? Tai Toshi is similar to um, <clears throat> this, but it's facing the other direction. Okay, and a lot of times when you go for a tie toshi, they'll spin out and you're actually hitting them with a soto toshi, right? So here, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna punch my uh, foot to the floor here, and uh, I'm gonna be end up throwing his head around, about right here, so the kazushi is gonna break his balance there, okay? Fall up with the knee on belly, some form of side control, or, or an arm bar, okay? Now, entry-wise, <laughs> I work this all the time, just stepping in as a direct attack, like I use it almost like a jab. Um, uh, Zabit, there's a guy that's fighting the UFC, at least recently landed in Osoto, uh, and he, he used like a sort of a step-in kick to get it, right? There's all sorts of entries, and you don't always need the, the traditional judo grip. As a matter of fact, like the longer I train, the more I, I, I work away from this. This is a great operating system while you're learning, particularly all the throws, and then learn all the gripping variations you can, and then I, now I'm in a phase where I'm trying not to rely on grips. I'm more trying to be here when I uh, work in with <coughs> getting in for underhooks or clinches or whatever it is I'm trying to do, right? So on this throw Soto, I like a no grip entry where <coughs> I'm going to uh, basically step in, he's leading with that leg, so I step here. Okay, so you don't get as much leg action. Here. Scissoring is, all, is kind of your kazushi, your balance break, right? So I come in. Osoto well, Toshi, white belt move. It's for everybody. Um, so if you're studying Judo, Jiu Jitsu, Aikido, any of that, I think this is a great throw uh, to work in your drills, right? Thanks for watching guys.